I hate looking for coaches in Football Manager. I really do. It's awful because you have so many slots to fill and it's hard to get the guy to want to go to your team. It's hard, especially if you don't have the reputation. It's just a mess. But let's see what we can do to make it a little bit better. Maybe make this a little bit more engaging and fun. And maybe we can get to know the personalities of our coaching staff. I've got four pieces of advice to make the search for coaching staff a little bit easier to stomach. First of all, instead of just zooming through it, try writing things out and arranging the staff yourself. You know, the best way to get to know somebody is to actually know their name. And in the past, I've never known the names of my coaches. I just chose the guys with the best numbers. So let's write out their names. Let's get to know who they are. And this is probably the first thing that we should do. Write them out. Second, look for younger coaches that might stick with the club a little bit longer. You don't want to sign a bunch of older guys who retire after one year. It's better if you have some coaches that stick with you maybe five, ten seasons and grow with the club. Third, consider using your coaching staff to expand the international reach of your club. If you hire foreign coaches, especially from the other side of the planet, you might learn more about players from their host countries or countries they've worked in. without having to scout those places. And number four, think of creative backstories for your staff members. Now, there are a lot of staff members who are real people but it, how much do you know about random coaches and medical staff members in real life football? Probably not a lot. So think of storylines you can create. For example, I made sure that our under 18 team is staffed 100% by Japanese coaches. But as players move up, they start to encounter the foreign coaches. That itself might be foundation of a somewhat interesting storyline.